everyone, Pushing Up Roses here. We're gonna play some more House MD. I have with me my very special guest, again, becoming less and less special, Lazy Game Reviews. Or, I'm not special anymore. Hi there. Or should I say Clint from Lazy Game Reviews because I've been told that you don't really like being referred to as LGR. I, I mean, it happens, but no, it is not me. You it's have a, a name. It's a title. <laughs> yeah. I understand. I just use my name for everything, so I don't really I don't really have that problem. Well, also, I, I just I just realized that the music of the game wasn't going and people were missing out on the, the beautiful house music, so I turned it on for everybody. House music? It's like a dance hall, but like mm, yeah, nightclubs. It is actually the music from uh, the intro, I believe. I don't know if it's the exact or if it's redone, but this is a, a game by a company called Legacy, and they also did Murder, She Wrote, and they did use, like, the Murder, She Wrote music, so... I was just thinking, like, house music, like EDM. Oh, like, like house music, like... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I Okay. So what are we doing? You've already done the first episode. What are I we doing I already did now? the first episode. I am going to go on to episode two. We're going to be, the last episode I played was called Globetrotting. I don't know if you remember it, but it involved uh, a guy who had his own show. He got really sick and it was all fake and stuff. You know how the house episodes, they have like other things they need to figure out? Kind of like it's mystery and it's medical. Well, it's originally based on the idea of uh, him being a medical Sherlock Holmes. So yeah, right. that's why there's so much snooping. That's why he has his Watson in the form of Wilson. And, you right. know, he's, he's even a W. You, you know, it, it's it's a very uh, derivative in that sense. But yeah, it definitely has its own uh, spin on that. So, yeah. so there's a lot of mystery the, going the game on. is too. You're mm -hmm. supposed to snoop and, you know, do all that. Oh, hello, yes. Cuddy. She's looking very pro in her blazer jacket. This must be uh, like pre-season five or whenever this thing came out. I don't know. I don't know when it came out. I'll have to check and I'll put it in the description. But for now, let us play episode two. Okay. Get ready. Everyone get ready to have your minds blown with our amazing voice acting. Oh, well, here we go. Listen, you moronic subhuman cretin. I'm running a very tight ship here, and when I tell you to bring me lunch at 1 o'clock, I don't mean 105. You got that? Look, uh, Lana, I've been working for you for... Got that? I said... No, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Lana. <laughs> oh. Don't I look just like Lana? I said, do you got that? Y yes. It looks just like you. It's not, not really. You could put some glasses on him and it might. Get back to your station. And then girl on the left just doesn't know what to do. Those chefs, man, they're just really intense. Ugh, I've made a mess of myself. Someone get me a paper towel. You've got to be kidding me. Russell, we don't have any decent paper towels. My hand's still covered in blueberry schmutz. Uh, that, that isn't blueberry schmutz. What do you mean? Y uh, you're... I'm what? I'm bad at talking, apparently. <laughs> You're turning violet, Violet. Oh. <laughs> ah, she's a smurf! Call 911. This episode is called Blue Meaning by that title screen you saw for about 0.5 seconds. <laughs> it's really quick. That was really there. quick. It's like, Blue <laughs> Meaning! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Blue Meaning, okay, we got it. <laughs> Lana Topol, I'm the patient who turned blue. Gregory House. I'm the doctor who recognizes the obvious when it's staring right at him. Okay, Dr. Gimpy, let's set some ground rules. You are not going to talk to me like that. <laughs> Fair so enough. You can stay blue for the rest of your life. Good luck with that. Wait. Look, I'm sorry. I'm just in a bad mood. I want to look normal again, okay? I think it's a very good look. Very Avatar. It's pretty wild. As far as you looking normal, that's something you and your plastic surgeon have to deal with. As for your condition, oh, we're snap. Check your signs and symptoms. Why is he the one doing this? Okay, yes. this is the most anti-house thing ever. He never checks the patient out first. Almost never. And, and th there's like, okay, sorry. Anyway. It's okay. No, I'm, t I'm telling you, know you the game's I mean? not like, that good. Yeah, they send, you know, the team, right? He doesn't even ever want to meet the patient unless he has to. 
Dude, this that... is odd, but not that odd. This woman got teeth problems. There's some broccoli chunk stuck up in there. It's called flossing, you know? Ah, whatever. House is actually British, I'm sure he Do you is. floss? Uh, yes. Oh, I, I don't. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why I'm preaching. I'm terribly unhygienic. So what are we doing? We are checking the patient for symptoms. So I checked her head. Okay. Um, this loss of like, consciousness and vomiting. This is definitely already so far from the ideas of the show is crazy. Because and she's got a dry throat. Wow. And uh, then I looked at her legs. <laughs> yep, they're blue. They're and blue. It's good enough there. And we're going to, let's see. Gotta get a magnifying glass so we can see the pores a little bit closer. I see that blue skin. If this is actually a house episode, he would be making some snarky remark about her bra choice. But he does that too. But they're the quips he has are just they're not very clever. No. To me, they're just abrasive. A chef turned blue in the middle of her restaurant. Okay. Either she's just had sex with Willy Wonka or. Actually, yeah, I like that idea, but I'll take any other suggestions. Ew. Why Willy right. Wonka? If anything, she'd be having sex with the blueberry... Oh, never mind. <laughs> with the blue... Period. Like the blueberry. With the blueberry. <laughs> with the, like the blueberry pie or whatever it was. Yeah, any... that doesn't make so much sense. I, I'm telling that's... you, these quips are just biting without punchline. Find the possible diagnosis that matches the word appearing in the whiteboard. Oh, right, so we're getting... Any... We're being timed and graded for this. Like, literally, I have to choose... Which one fits here? So there's like an A right here. So I have to see maybe this one. Okay. Acro. Uh, she uh, could have a connective tissue disorder. Acrocinosis. Ac it explains her blue fingers. It does. But what nothing else. else. Mm. Next. I am so good at clicking on floating words. I should do this professionally. This is really tough. All the answers are out there, just floating around. We just the have truth to is out them. there, as they say. Oh, so we have like a like a hangman thing going on up there. Yeah. Uh, ooh, our our Argeria Argeria makes people turn blue. It's possible. If she used gold flakes in any of those expensive desserts, they could be swept up and aerosolized into her lungs. Heavy metal poisoning. Heavy metal. <laughs> yeah, but it doesn't explain the loss of consciousness or the vomiting. Speaking of vomit, your diagnoses make me want to puke. Next. Dang it. Man, that was really biting. I, I, it's just bad, I'm telling you right now. Okay, so there's an O right there. Doesn't help. This one? Oh, oh my, look, am I good? Yes, so I'm great. good. Hardcore Gamer, it's my new screen name. Please don't. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so hardcore, you guys. Made my screen name. So, uh, yeah, this is fun. I know. But at least these uh, portraits looks kind of nice, right? Right? Yeah, they're all, you know. Hey, already again, aneurysm explains the abdominal pain, the shock, the lack of consciousness. If Lana had an aortic an aneurysm, she wouldn't have blue skin. She has more of a bluish pallor. Bluish pallor, right. Before I turn blue from strangling myself in despair because of these awful diagnoses, who's got something to save me? Oh. House, why aren't you doing this? Like, seriously. Man, this is like. I know. Drawing Nicotine. out this like little scene that happens in each episode, but. I know. Nicotine overdose, nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, and seizures are all symptoms. Okay, but she's still blue. They gonna make a joke about how short he is? Come on. But the hallmark of nicotine overdose is muscle twitching and cramps, which Lana doesn't have. Yes, muscle twitching, otherwise known as. Okay. <laughs> Just say fascination. Fa he sounds it. He says it in the line. Fasciculation? Fasciculation? Which sounds like fascination. This is anything but fascinating next. Oi, do we have to fill up this entire... Fasciculation Street, hit song by The Cure. Mm. Get it? Like The Cure? Fasciculation? Here. I made it. I made a hospital joke. It's better than the ones in here. I know, right? 
should be a writer. Comedy writer. For There's bad a... games. Oh, wow, I got first try? I'm so good at this. Oh. It does explain all the symptoms. Very good, Foreman. And if you like, I'll reward you with a blueberry tart. Or a blueberry muffin, a blueberry smoothie, a plush Smurfette doll, maybe. What are you implying? B minus? Guess it's not as bad as if you'd killed the patient. That is a... That's an expression if I ever saw one. <laughs> and what... Is he, like, playing a game? What is this? Ah, uh, he probably is. He's drawing... A, he's, oh, he's, like, got things on his calendar. Oh, it's like a calendar. Probably drawing things in there, though. It's like a giant coffee stain. Something immature. So what? It's because we didn't do it quickly enough? Or I got a couple wrong. Yeah. Looks like our big, bad-tempered blueberry has methamoglobinemia. Okay. Mm. Instead yes. of finding hatred, bile, and evil in her bloodstream, she's probably just got an excessive amount of methamoglobin, whatever. And who did the arterial blood test? It's weird. I did a pulse oximetry blood test on Lana, and her PO2 indicates an oxygen, oxygen saturation of 90%, but Lana's was at 83%. There's a gap of 7% in case you're really bad at math. <laughs> wow, Tab, you're Jewish and good at math. Amazing, Ooh. except you're wrong. Uh, pulse oximetry measures how well lungs are carrying oxygen to the blood, but not the actual saturation of oxygen in the blood. Okay, what color is Lana's blood? And it's not, Blue? It's not... Dark. No, it's not dark. You're dark. I think you mean brown. 13, Foreman test Lana's oxygen saturation levels with a CO oximetry blood test. Co uh, while you're at it, see if you can get Lana to make me one of those tinfoil swans. Those are really classic. Like, see, that's like really like, I feel like that's just forced in there. Like this extra line. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, is that Lana's blood? Or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> oh, no. Uh, yep, let's get this co chemistry <laughs> test underway. So you are happy to see me. Aren't they dating? I think they're dating. Well, they might have been at this point. I would like to introduce you to the most skillful minigame you will have ever seen. Turning on the centrifuge. I'm literally just moving my mouse around in circles. And then you just hold it there. What, what? I'm a doctor. So, this is not an autumn. Like, what is the, the power run out? Is the motor dead? It's Wilson. Good job, but don't let it go to. Why is he commenting on this? He's just commenting on your performance. He's like stalking you. Okay, you've been doing great lately. If you need a consult on anything, I'll be happy to help. I'll lend you a helping hand while you do these lab procedures. That should help you get them done much faster. I don't know if he actually does or not, but this uh, thing is... Uh, I've done uh, uh, this minigame so many times. This looks like something out of gizmos and gadgets. Like, literally, I don't even need the instructions anymore. I just already know how to do it. So 9, 10, 11 are closed. Or Widget Workshop. It really does. It looks like one of those little edutainment game science puzzles. Man, they like having you spin things around, don't they? I know, like my freaking hand hurts because I'm spinning things all day. Close about seven and eight. Wow, Close this eleven. This is great. Like, do you kind of see what's going on as I do this? Yeah, I don't know what the point is, but I guess they wanted you to do something because most of the time it seems to be just like tossing some random dialogue at you to make you think like oh well this is like house you are going to we actually have some uh, dialogue options soon well that's good yeah um, there's actually interrogation parts that whoa I that was way too much i over i overspin that my bad sorry. oh no well, sorry going to look at you begrudgingly <laughs> Actually, uh, Cuddy is the one who berates you if you do bad. Well, of course. Yeah, she puts you on probation. <laughs> Which means what? You gotta come right back and try again? No, you don't even... You don't even... I got an A. Oh, good. And a hundred and... Two hundred points. It's like perfect or something? It's beyond perfect. Oh, With Negative four penalties? Negative? 
How do I get negative four? That's well, better think than anything it ever. Takes you away or something. I don't know. So now we have to select <laughs> like, the right top. We're not asking about corned beef. Yes, we are. A lean of corned beef. It is so lean. The cows, they be tipping <laughs> over. Really? What are the chances we have two videos in a row? No. Talk about corned beef. It's, I it's hope corn. it happens again in the future. Corned beef. 